And you are sure we will have those defense batteries up and running? No, 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 no. I'm not sure. They're in bad shape, Del. Really bad shape. I I'm already using duct tape and spit to keep the station from falling apart, and you want me to pull a rabbit out of my hat? I don't want to hear excuses. I want to hear that it's going to be fixed. Period. Get it done. All right, all right. I'm on it. You want to quit standing there and hand over the conduction grid data? Ah, perfect. I'll take that. <laughs> Dependable as always. Unlike some people we know. Oh, that's real funny. All right, listen up, because I don't want to repeat this twice. We've gotten word that UC Sysdef is massing somewhere nearby for an attack on the key. While we prepare for their arrival, I want you to head straight for Bannock 4 and bring Crix's legacy home. Lay it out, Jess. All right, first things first. I'm gonna upload this data you snagged from Jennerdyne into the key's databanks. All you need to do is build and then install a conduction grid module onto your ship. Oh, and if you haven't already, you'll need the comp spike module installed as well. Once your ship is ready, jump out to Bannock 4, board the Legacy, and bring us the cash. Of course there's a catch. What, you thought this would be easy? After you board the Legacy, be on the lookout for two transfer modules. They're special keys that allow access to the ship's vault. Once you locate the vault's control center, hook up the data core I'm gonna give you, and download everything they've got. And before you get any bright ideas, like running off with the money, that currency is going to be heavily encrypted. Only a genius like Shinya will be able to crack that encryption. So bring it back here right away. Which is exactly why you need to get there first, and we can't let it fall into their hands. Look, I'm gonna make this real simple for you. If that money ends up anywhere but the key, I will hunt you down and pry it out of your dead hands myself. Now get moving. Come back with Crix's legacy. Or don't come back I need at to all. get those defensive batteries online, so make this fast. Not a problem. Conduction grid data is all set up in the system, so it should be an easy install. I bet you would. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Let's take a look. to one of the officers. All support ships have arrived, Commander. Good. After we're done here, arrange a briefing. I want all of their CEOs over here as Early soon as possible. Early reports say your mission on the side yes, was sir. a success. I'm sure the Commander is pleased. There you are. Where have you been? Don't mistake what you're doing as some sort of heroic gesture. We're all risking our lives here. I've received the reports about your little foray into Genadyne. Last piece of the puzzle before you go after Crix's legacy. Which means it's time to put all the cards on the table and prepare to attack the key. Good. The more confusion and panic we cause, the more damage we can potentially inflict. Before you jump to Bannock 4, 
I need to make one thing abundantly clear. The credits from that Gal Bank transport cannot reach the fleet. You have to bring them here at all costs. If Delgado gains access to those resources, we might be touching up a battle we can't possibly win. We've been monitoring the Crimson Fleet's comm chatter and the Crick system. They're gathering allies by making promises based on your success. As much as I hate to admit it, UCC's death won't stand a chance. The fleet will become stronger and more unified than ever. I've always known that when it came down to it, you'd do the right thing. All right, I guess this is it. Do whatever prep you need to do aboard the Vigilance, and then head out to Bannock 4. When you return here with Crix's legacy, we'll begin the attack. Good luck. All my hopes go with you. Good luck.
not hesitate to use force. is an active industrial site. It would be advisable to wear a hard hat. Warning. This unit is well equipped for combat.
Reporting initiated. Son of a bitch! Nothing. Complete waste of time. I've tried everything I can possibly think of and I end up right where I started. Oh, here I thought I was so clever. Thought I had it all figured out. First, fix my ship and get the prototype shielding back online. Second, shunt the power from the cred tank array back to the system to drain the credits. And then third, haul ass back to my ship before the EM field rips apart the legacy. Three easy steps, right? Only problem is, I'm stuck at step one. Every system on my ship is dead, and there's nothing aboard this ship to use for repairs. I can't believe I came all this way just to end up stuck here like the poor bastards who ran this ship. <sighs> Actually, wait a second. Isa. Crew recording initiated. Well, now. External communication detected. Automated recording system activated. Legacy. Come in. This is Isa Melant. Are you there, Legacy? Holy shit. Isa? Is that you? Isa, I I'm here. Yes, I can read you. Jasper Creeks. You're still alive? You always were one tough son of a bitch. Yeah. I'm alive. No thanks to you. A month? Really? You left me to sit here and panic for a month. We said you'd wait a week. Tops! Wait a moment. I, I think broadcasting from outside the EM field is interfering with my comms. Did I just hear Jasper Freaks the Great admit that he was my Yeah, yeah. Uh, how about we cut the crap and you get my ass out of here? Come on, there has to be millions of credits here. We're rich. Uh, you know what? I think I'm going to Well, you didn't notice it was planned. 
Every soldier here is ready for the fight. After all this sneaking around, we're everyone's saying this is it. My God, is that it? Is that Crix's legacy? <sighs> Amazing. Ensign, take this and enter it into the data core analyzer. I'm on it, sir. You see, Lieutenant? I told you he wouldn't let us down. I have to admit, I'm impressed. Encrypted or not, that's quite a lot of money to be carrying around. The temptation must have been excruciating. Well, you came through. Now, on to other more pressing matters. We received confirmation that the fleet ships were scouts sent to probe our defenses. Unfortunately, one of them grabbed, jumped away before you arrived. Which means that Delgado will have the Crimson Fleet prepping defenses of its own. That's the plan. Lieutenant, if you wouldn't mind explaining our strategy. Yes, sir. The Vigilance is equipped with the latest in hyper-resistant shielding, making it the only ship that can safely approach the key. The catch is that the key has access to three orbital defensive batteries that can fire electromagnetic energy. One hit, and we lose those fancy shields. Our mission is to take out those batteries. In fact, I'll be personally leading the assault on Battery Alpha. I need you to be my support. Sadly, we didn't get as much support for this mission as I would have liked. There just wasn't enough evidence gathered. We weren't able to convince Mass to lend us additional squadrons. They feel like they've committed too many resources already. That means we'll have to take out all three batteries ourselves. It's unfortunate, yes. But we wouldn't be here if I didn't believe you could do it. We've also given you a call sign, Renegade, to help coordinate our movements during the attack. Once those batteries are destroyed, you board the key and bring Delgado to justice. You won't come quietly. You do what you have to do. I knew we could count on your support. Well, this is it. After years of planning, it all comes down to this moment. All my hopes and my best wishes go with you. Good luck. <laughs>